WWE Universe, prepare to be shooshed. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the Alpha Academy from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 202 pounds, Chad Gable. Uncle Howdy is here. Bray Wyatt's visions have come to life. And now, no one is safe. We've seen Uncle Howdy many times, but his actions, his motivations are still unknown. I'm so confused about so much when it comes to Howdy. We've seen him aid Bray Wyatt. Other times he's attacked Bray Wyatt. Heck, is he really even Bray's uncle? Well, one thing's for sure. Uncle Howdy is a frightening opponent for any competitor. Guys, can I be honest for a second? I am... Really scared. We know. Aren't you guys? I'm just sort of darkly curious. It's impossible to look away because there's no telling what happens next. Hey, howdy. Byron's been talking about you. No, oh, no, 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 no. Quiet, Michael. Be quiet. He said your mask is stupid just and you don't scare him. Stop, Corey. You're going to get me hurt. Byron, get your hand off my leg. There's the bell, and Uncle Howdy is in the ring. Prepare to watch horror unfold in front of your very eyes. Uncle Howdy torments those who stand before him, implores them to embrace the darkness. These are forces from another world, entities that most mortals can't understand at work here. Uncle Howdy's real. He's very real. There's still room to learn something new here today, though, because he's about to get taught a painful lesson by the master, Chad Gable. Former Olympian, championship pedigree, and just a fierce competitor is Chad Gable. He can wrestle circles around just about anybody you put him in the ring with. As much as I hate his attitude, there are worse guys to learn from. Quick thinking pays off. Oh, attack to the midsection. At this point of the match, I'm not surprised. What a clothesline! Uh-oh! He takes control! Looking wobbly in the corner. And well-timed maneuver there. Hardy's such an imposing figure. How does Uncle Howdy gain an advantage in this match? No one embraces the darkness like Uncle Howdy. Heck, he revels in it. And that's what gives him a psychological advantage. Uncle Howdy has no fear of the aftermath. No fear of how far he will go to hurt people. And with an onslaught of strikes like that, it's clear they have nothing but punishment on their mind. Yeah. Tagged with a punch. <laughs> and he had Uncle Howdy's numb. Sky high. Diving front drop kick. In complete control of their opponent here. Into a DDT! And shoulders are down. Two, a kick out before three. He's determined to keep this matchup going. Ball driver on its way. Oh, oh man. Spiked him. 
There's a certain amount of anger you have to have towards your opponent to pile drive them like that. He got whipped into that corner, and Gable's lesson plan just got thrown off. An unsettling amount of pain being inflicted by Uncle Howdy. Ah, oh, right to the throat. Heading up, he's thinking big. Lift off. Elbow drop. Goes into the pin. Two count, and he kicks out at two. This could be a tipping point in this match. Oh. This is nothing short of disturbing. Oh, so frightening. So bizarre. So eerie. It's Welcome get worse. to Sister Abigail. And Uncle Howdy is giving me chills after that move. Is it enough? The cover. Where in the world does one fight? Oh, look at the start of this. Could be going into the playbook for submission. Dragon sleeper. Oh. Clever escape. Oh, he's gonna get it now. Chad Gable with a German suplex not done yet, has not released. Arm still climbs around the waist. A second German suplex. Nice. Will Gable make it pay off? Oh, no, he could be caught here. Bad spot for him. Locking it in. Ankle. Rolls through. Able to escape the ankle lock. Elusiveness from Gable. What a forearm! Taking a trip outside, he's got to be mindful of the count. Does he get him here? Fights the shoulder up in one. I can't believe it. He just won't go away. He's able to sidestep there. Vicious right forearm. Trading back and forth blows now. Giving up now is not an option. They have to finish this. Slugging away with everything they've got. Both absolutely drained, but both refusing to give up. This is a war of attrition with neither superstar wanting to be the one who surrenders. Two fighters putting their haymakers on autopilot right now. Went into the corner now. Punch right to the face. Guys, I can't think of a worse place for him to be right now. Big right hand finds the mark. Plotting something painful. Avalanche overhead, belly to belly. The end may be in sight for his opponent here. This is a very dangerous situation now. From the top. Oh, elbow drop. Oh, it's a piercing elbow. And Gable is taking command of this one. Uncle Howdy has to weather a storm here. Good Lord, scarily close to three. We are seeing these men leaving it all on the line. No stone being left unturned. Everything the body can give is being brought to the table. Our ringer applied. Top wrist lock, opponent down to one knee. Ooh, and a shot to the body and another. Slice bread, what a counter. Power slam. Looking for a high-risk move. From the top. You gotta be kidding me. And that was a collision you don't want to be on the receiving end of. Came down like a wrecking ball on a cinder block. Everyone watching this is on pins and needles. What a match. A battle for taking flight. Diving headbutt. Cover. Two. That's really as close as it gets. Chad Gable goes behind, holds up his opponent. Nice German suplex. Only going for another. And why not? Let's get a trifecta. Trick by Gable. End of the line for Uncle Howie. Cover. Kicks out. Just kicked out. Unbelievable presence of mind. Okay, this just got freaky. This got really freaky. Oh, my gosh. Well, good thing that's over, am I right? Yeah, let's hope that never happens again, but something tells me that's a pipe dream. And 
what a reversal from Chad Gable. Able to interrupt the attack. Placed on the top turnbuckle, back to their competitor. Oh. Uh-oh, going up top. This isn't going to be good. He went right into that turnbuckle. This won't end well. Hard shot to the lower back. And that's just the beginning. Now oh, it's German suplex. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Toss back into the ring. The crowd is fired up. Howdy is fired up. Taking this to the floor. Boom! Oh, what a crash. He's heading to the floor, but he... Jack Gable going behind, hooks up his opponent. Nice German suplex. Holding it up for another. And why not? Let's get a trifecta. I don't care who you are, you can't survive any more of those. Snapmare could set something else up. Boom! A forearm smash! Such a spirited assault from Gable. Gable has his opponent figured out. Boom! Into a DDT. Beautiful, simply beautiful maneuver from Chad Gable. Chad Gable goes behind, hooks up his opponent. Nice German suplex. Let's get a trifecta! Chad with the exclamation mark. Getting set up for something in the corner. No. 
nothing short of disturbing. Oh, so frightening. So bizarre. So I think we're about to see a masterful pinning combination. Oh, my. Oh, wow. This could be a victory. He gets the win, but at what cost? Here is your winner, Chad Gable. That came out of nowhere. And an unexpectedly quick end to this match. Clever is really the only word that can describe that victory. However you want to describe it, it certainly worked.